I've recorded playbacks, audio playbacks of some of my videos and fed them into a software program where you can plot a spectrum of, of your, your sound. This is called Audacity and this is my second most popular video, the one with just under a million views right now, which I thought was F sharp 7, but the peak it's given me from the software is actually F7. So most of that time you're hearing that note, it's, it's actually an F7, if there is a, a higher one in there. I got a later one called Slightly Higher Note, and this is much more recent. This has a peak in it, about there on the scale, which corresponds to that number, which is a B7. That one was somewhat higher. You have to catch these things at exactly the right moment to find the highest point. With this one, I actually had two peaks on one version. There, there was a peak over to the left of the one you can see the highest here. And this one really surprised me. I thought for years that it was uh, something like a G-sharp 7. And it was actually a combination of the C-sharp 7 and the C-sharp 8 in one version that I found. But this one is, I got the peak isolated and I found where it's just the one note more concentrated and it's the C-sharp 8. My happy new note, this is the one with the hyperventilation. I filmed, got this, this moment at about 1 minute 40 seconds or so. This came out to a D8. That's a little bit higher. You have to get all these at just the right moment. They're kind of snapshots. And still higher note is the one you see there. I'll beak a little bit more to the right. And that is an F8. So this is the same note I talk about in Confusing Octaves, where years before I thought I was singing an F8, and I was actually singing an F7. It actually turned out to be a little prophetic because years later it seems like I actually have hit the F8. But in one version of this, a few tenths of a second different for the sampling time, this is about 30, 31 seconds into the, the file, I've actually got a double peak. And the one on the, on the right here is higher. There's a C-sharp to the left and a G-sharp 8 to the right. I don't know if I can isolate a G sharp there. It actually is a moment where it's clearly the highest. It's clearly the, the peak of the distribution. But that's what I 